Hello guys, this is Ramin with Ramin Digital on YouTube and RaminDigital.com. I wanted to, I have a new um, Vegas Pro tutorial for all of our editors who like to edit music videos. Uh, because uh, part of our business at Ramin Digital Media, we do a lot of post-production editing, whether it be the TV series, small ones of course, not a, not a network, but also music video or do documentary. So we do a lot of post-productions. Um, we use a lot of the effects, a lot of the, the color uh, or, or image manipulation that Vegas Pro Tools has. I wanted to share a like, couple of them with you guys, showing you one of these music videos that we just worked on last month. And I think it came out cool. You can apply this technique to your music videos or regular videos of your kids, whatever it is. Um, this is our, uh, we were working on this music video, which is a very cool one. You see how the, 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 the lights come through, there, there's some moving lights in the background in the stage. I just wanna show you a good scene. Okay, what, what this does, like this is the original, original footage. So you see there, there are a bunch of lights hanging on the, in, this, in this warehouse and they're just static, they're not doing anything. Which, is, which it looks okay, but I brought this up to the, to, to the director uh, who shot the footage. I said, well, can we do something about it? And he, was, he said, let me see what you can, you can do. Anyway, I, I figured, you know, this light static, you need to, this is just too bland, the guy is dancing over there. So, rays, not light rays, this is just a rays. So you bring your luminous rays and you put it on your footage. Okay, now this has a whole bunch of stuff in there. This is one of the very kind of complicated what's on your So when you turn it on, as soon as by default, it's gonna have some information. I mean, it has some effect on there. You see every little lights in here in the background, they have a, a, a spotlight kind of rays coming out of them, okay? So, which is fine. And then if you play your, uh, your clip, it just, they're just static, okay? Now you want to animate this thing. So open up your anim animate track and go into the beginning. So this is our beginning. I uh, set up the, the X and Y at a certain position. So the, the parameters that you want to work with is the X and Y. This X and Y goes uh, horizontal and Y goes the, the light destination and source to the vertical. So we start out here, then go about, I don't know, maybe a couple of seconds and put a, put a anchor there. Now you, you can adjust the X and Y position. Watch when I do the X position. You see our, our spotlights, our light rays, see how they change from right goes all the way to left. Okay, so I wanna bring this here on our point and also the Y is up and down. So I wanted to bring it down. So now if you play your video, you're gonna see those light rays are moving back and forth. So go a little, a little bit more here and then reverse them back. So go to the right and go all the way to the top. Okay, uh, you get that. You get the meaning. And then once you play it, you see those those spotlights. They're just moving in the background. So you can match it to your music or to your video. So this was a this was a cool effect we added in there. Actually, we ran it by the director of the footage. He actually liked it, and he said that the video went out like this. And we left it throughout the entire entire footage. So every part had this thing on there. So I, I hope again uh, you get the gist of it. Again, it's a light rays going there, going to your field effects, play around with it. I mean, you, you, you cannot do any possibly. All you gotta do is just delete it and restart again. So put a, and then uh, maybe you can put another track in there, another anchor point in there and change the hue, change the color to like this red one and then change the Y all the way to the top and X all the way to the side. Uh, give it a boost to the power and just play around with the numbers and see how, what works the best for you. And then when you're playing your footage. I hope you guys like this video. I hope you're gonna try this thing. Uh, try Luminous. Uh, Vegas Pro has a tons and tons and tons of um, effects as you see on, on the effects tab. I'm gonna try to show you as much as I can, maybe one at a time. But but these are the effects that we use every day for our video production and post-production and whatnot. I hope you guys enjoy this thing. If you like this video, please don't forget to like and subscribe so I can bring you more stuff like this. Thanks guys.